Okay, so really quickly, um, they do things that throw you off about this. I changed my voice. But if you look at the picture, the picture I'm put on the screen is me at 17 years old. I'm going to put two pictures on the screen. They try to demonize me because, you know, I'm trying to make it so I look gay. So one of them I made uh, gray. The other one I'm going to keep the same. They're probably going to make it look clownish. They're going to probably make it look weird and crazy and gayish. And they're probably going to change this audio track, you know, the the voice uh, on the on the video. Okay. But notice that I'm more intense and focused and sharp than that clueless chick. Are we equal? No. Does everyone evolve or develop in their lifetime at the same rate? No. So when I was more intense than that clueless chick will ever be in her whole life, Alicia Silverstone, and basically every female there is, why should I have to suffer, right? Why did I have to suffer when I was 17 being shunned by women? I should have been married by 16 because I'm more mature at 16 than other guys are when they're 40 and 50. I should have been married to like a 25-year-old at 16 or married to a female who's uh, uh, submissive, who's my same age, okay? There's a lot of things people don't understand. We do not all develop at the same rate. That's why people have uh, developmental disorders, okay? Various disorders. And some of them have to do with developing slow. So this is part of what they, they mean by Babylon is baby line, right? It's when the, 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 the pagans started saying that the angels were baby-faced. Some more started to say that her, they're hermaphrodites. That's what they taught people when they were, I was younger. They probably still teach it, okay? It's not true. Angels are not hermaphrodites. They're not baby face. Those are pagan ideas. Hermaphroditus, right? Hermes merged with Aphrodite, where we get the word hermaphrodite. That's a pagan idea, okay? So these people develop slow. They're not mature enough to truly value virtue. Ver in virtue means man, and to be intensely masculine is to be intensely virtuous. You don't see other people putting God first, okay? The point here isn't to insult people. Some women like guys who aren't that masculine. They like guys who, who are gender neutral and blah, 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 blah. And that's them. But why should everyone sabotage me and cheat me out of my right to lead, which has the inevitable effect of cheating me out of a suitable helper, financial sabotage, what have you? Why they're hoarding trillions and trillions of dollars, okay? And they're hoarding billions of dollars in their churches and so on and so forth. It is so outrageous. So, so outrageous. They want to confuse you by how I talk. My dad's from Nigeria. My mom's uh, a white American. I don't talk like a gay person. I, you know, Nigeria is the least tolerant of homosexuality on the planet. I don't talk like an African American. I talk like me. And they're trying to confuse you about this. And it's fucking, fucking, fucking pathetic. I don't talk like a Jew. I don't talk like a white person. Okay? And and they edit my pictures and all this. You think you think people aren't going to believe me when I say that I'm six foot four? My dad's Nigerian and he's like 250 pounds and, you know, it was like all muscle back in the day and a brain surgeon. And you think they're not going to believe me that my brain is more intense than theirs, that I'm more masculine than they are? It's fucking retarded. That's like Pee Wee Herman saying, saying to Mr. T, they'll never believe that you're more macho than I am. Right? It's fucking retarded. Okay, except for this is that sharp, focused, moral intensity, masculine, romantic intensity in regards to being a truly being a man and manning up with universal pinpoint and moral precision in reality, in reality, in reality. Okay? It is fucking retarded that they do not know to stop. The gap, the masculinity gap between me and the governing class is so great that they still have not corrected their mistake. They still haven't manned up even a little bit or else they would have stopped immediately. They would have stopped persecuting me, stopped editing my videos, stopped changing my pictures, stopped trying to pretend they're ideal while they're clicking their heels like those, those weird fairy images. And I, you know, I'll put in the next video, Ball and Serapis, right? Literally, I have a picture of Ball Baal Haman that looks almost exactly like uh, uh, their fake Jesus image. And Ham on, on his Raw's call center. He's superimposed on the Royal African Falcon martial art order. Ra is also depicted as a falcon at times, just like Horus. Horus, the falcon, son of the falcon. Okay? And the Bible says a warrior anointed a warrior. And these ideas are all superimposed on the Royal African Falcon top martial artist order including their fake versions of Horus. They make them like a fairy, you know, in Egypt as well, if those images are real, they, make them a, they made them a fairy uh, a version of a royal African falcon, serious masculine person, because these people were gender neutral. They, refers, they refused to man up, and, and they often, you know, look at Amen Ra, you look at Atum and Happy. These are gender neutral, weird kind of guys, okay? 
Now, if that's what you are by nature and you don't want to change, that's you. But you have no right to change my image. Even when it comes to your own family members, you do not have a right to lie to your children about what God's son looked like. Shame on you people for thinking that that was what you should do.